All right, you guys, welcome back to the channel. So before we get into this one, uh, I just want to thank everybody for uh, all of yesterday's comments uh, and participation in that uh, ration. That was really awesome. Um, that's really what you know makes makes it worth it for me is to get everybody um, working together, um, coming together, um, and just with your comments and everything, it's really awesome. Cause it's it is what it's it's making it worth it because you know I have to be honest YouTube's not uh, YouTube hasn't been nice with the channel lately um, ever since we've hit a thousand subscribers um, YouTube's participation I feel in the channel has drastically dwindled um, I'm I'm not in this for the money but it takes a lot of money to run this channel and. You know, I would expect that, you know, YouTube's with their participation, you know, um, I get a little bit back from that just for the views and it's really not a whole lot, but it just feels like they're done participating and promoting the channel because I mean, we have like over 400 videos and, uh, you think that it would get out there more, but I've also had a lot of people tell me that, um, they don't really promote, um, they don't promote military videos or MRE videos, but I mean, I'm not sure. I mean, there's a lot of guys out there that have a lot of views. I'm not really sure why. Like, I mean, my my videos aren't the best, but I know that they're really infor informational, informal. Um, I don't know if it's like the thumbnails. It's not catching people's eyes, but I really don't think it's that either. I just really think it's YouTube just not really promoting, so... You know they need to get their they need to get their things straight and start helping us out over here so we can start pumping out more videos because I mean I'm not gonna stop um, I enjoy doing this the wife supports me um, I mean if you look almost each ration or whatever I've got that I've done it's about twenty dollars I would just say minimum twenty bucks we have four over four hundred channel or four hundred videos. Because there are some that I have deleted, plus all the giveaways. I mean, you can do the math. It's it's a lot of money, but I, I enjoy what I'm doing. But I really just think that YouTube needs to get their get their uh, story straight and kind of, you know, give me give give the channel what it deserves. But you guys, you guys are awesome. You guys have done plenty. Um, I I appreciate everything that you guys have have done. Uh, you've done more than enough, so I'm going to give back to you guys. We're going to be doing more giveaways. We have one coming up pretty soon. I'm going to do it on the 1400th uh, subscriber, which, you know, hopefully you won't take that long. And, uh, yeah, so anyway, we're going to we're gonna do something a little interesting. I know that it's it's not that time of year yet, but I happen to cut. I still have these cases, by the way, of Hormel. I have, like two cases of these things that we bought back in the day uh like last year i believe and uh we only got through like one or two of them um uh, because they weren't really popular videos for some reason um but these are you know the shelf stable episodes that i was doing and i haven't really done one yet i don't know if i'm going to continue to name them those because it just seems like you know if i named it the shelf stable episode it wasn't getting a lot of views but um Anyway, we're going to check this out and see what Hormel's version of a Thanksgiving dinner is going to be. So basically, this is just turkey and the dressing. That's nothing more. 20 grams of protein, ready in 60 seconds. We've got oven roasted white turkey with traditional dressing and rich turkey gravy. You know, these things are really good because the fact that, you know, they're shelf stable, they'll last a while. But I've also noticed that these have... Oh, that was one reason I need to get through these. They're already expired. 218 or 24. So... It's uh, it's been uh, over a month. I'm sure they're still good. I'm going to give it a try. Um, but we should probably blast through this case. And the other case. Just to get them out of the way. We might hold on to a couple just to see um how long they will hold their shelf life i mean that is really you know good information to know as well uh how long these can be stored for i did get these off um 
Amazon, which is funny that the, the date is already, but we, we've had these for a while. I'll have to go back and look to see how long we've had these. But anyway, enough jibber jabbering about that. You guys are waiting for the best part. Let's see, we've got 290 calories in this. Oh my god. That's insane. Look at the sodium count on that. This thing could be like preserved forever. 43% of this is salt. That's insane. Woo! All right, well, let's get this in the microwave. Vent tray for one minute. Let's stand for a minute and then serve and enjoy. So, let's get at it, shall we? All right, so nothing fancy. We're gonna eat it right out of the tray that it came in. Interesting so far. Let's see what we've got here. Okay, so we've got. Yeah, let's get this out on a plate and better look at this a lot better. All right, let's take a look at what we've got because it looks like to put the patty on top. And they got the the stuffing on the bottom. Now, is this an actual piece of turkey? No, it's got it's definitely processed. I don't think it is a slice. There we go. So one minute was definitely not enough in the microwave. And this is the stuffing, which does not resemble stuffing at all. The turfy turkey tastes heavily processed. And that's probably the worst stuffing. I had a little chunk of celery in there. The gravy just drowns everything out. Like it literally doesn't. Uh, all you taste is gravy. I think I got a little taste of like water chestnut. Yeah, this is a uh, very sad for a Thanksgiving dinner. I would be depressed. I mean, it doesn't it's not bad, but the problem is that gravy. I mean, that doesn't even taste like turkey. Like, it literally does not have no turkey taste whatsoever. None. And it tastes, it tastes, um, I don't think that uh, being out of date has anything to do with anything. It literally all just tastes the same. And this stuffing has, doesn't even have the texture of stuffing. Which is probably even worse. It's literally like mashed potato. Sad. You'd be better off going to Denny's. <laughs> Honestly, if you had to on a holiday, instead of relying on this, you'd have a you'd have a better experience getting a hungry man meal, turkey dinner, because this is it's not horrible. But it's not anything what, first off, what the picture looked like or what you would expect. You know, it's like <coughs> cheap cans of gravy that you get at the store, like the store brand ones. That's all this tastes like. Not one hint of turkey taste in that period. So, 
Um, it'll get you by if you're hungry. Other than that, there's nothing special about that. Probably, be honest with you, the worst Hormel ones I've had are these Hormel Completes. Um, now you could you could dress it up yourself. You could get uh, some mashed potatoes and um, some vegetables and add it to this. But if you're just going to eat it sing singly like this, nah. But I will leave a just link in the description of where I bought these for you guys if you are interested. <clears throat> because they come in a variety case and there's some pretty good ones that are in there. And I just think it's a really good idea to have uh, a wide array of different uh, shelf-stable items so you're not stuck eating the same thing all the time. So, anyway guys, uh, that'll do it for today's video. Um, have a safe and wonderful weekend, everyone. Until next time, have a good one.